Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year. I'm so honored, I'm so happy to congratulate you during this holy season. And thinking about Christmas, I'm thinking about the story of Mary, Joseph, being engaged and Mary already pregnant before they were married. And uh, I could imagine how crazy the situation was for Joseph. I think Mary was a little bit like, you no, know, I knew what was going on because an angel appeared to her and I mean, at least a little bit she knew what was happening. But for Joseph, that was raw. For Joseph, that was a big chaos. And while he was thinking about just, uh, you know, privately leaving her, not making a public shame of her, the Bible says an angel of God appeared to him in a dream and told him not to be afraid to take Mary as his wife because what she has is of the Holy Spirit. So I want to encourage you with that Christmas story for you to know that when things will be tense in your life, when you won't understand what is going on in your life, I wish that you hear the voice of God that says, don't be afraid. I am with you in your trial. I will see you too. If I saw Joseph through and Jesus was born and the, the, the story changed, the same will happen for you. So as you celebrate Christmas, just know Christmas is to remind us about the, that the impossible is possible and that Jesus came to die for our sins, to deliver us from our sins and to get us to heaven. And I am also wishing you a happy new year and I pray that the year will really be new, that you will find a lot of new things, a lot of new touches you can put in the things you already have. I pray that you will have a lot of improvement in the new year and you will enjoy God, your faith, your life during the new year and good people will surround you as you yourself become a better person. Enjoy your holidays. God bless you.